been a whirlwind couple of weeks for you, mate. Atlanta, now you're in the Valley. I mean, how are you feeling about how it's all been playing out? I'm feeling a lot more relaxed now that, uh, you know, I feel like I've found, found a home in, in Phoenix and, um, you know, that's a, that's a great organisation to be a part of right now. You know, they're building towards something special and I'm, I'm really excited to be a part of that. Uh, you know, there's the, that, that, that situation again, it just kind of puts hairs on your chest and it, it really teaches you a lot about yourself. So, uh, you know, nerve wracking times kind of going into that. I'd never experienced it. Luckily, I had an engagement party to keep my mind out of that, you know, out of that gutter. But, um, you know, going, going into it, I feel like I really got nervous at the last minute. And so that was, that was kind of nice. But, you know, going through that as a part of this gig is what we sign up for. So f for me, there were stages where I was maybe feeling sorry for myself, but you know, it's what you sign up for and this is what it takes to be at the highest level. So um, I'm, I'm happy that I'm, I'm with Phoenix now. I'm really excited. I've been here meeting them all today and they're great guys and, and we love the city. So, uh, you know, it's, it's a step in the right direction. We've obviously loved watching every step of your career, right? Through St Mary's and onwards and upwards to this point. Well, what's the next thing on your to-do list? Yeah, uh, that's, you know, I, I, I said this recently in an interview, but there's not a whole lot more in terms of, in terms of winning that I can really tick off. So, uh, you know, right now it's, I've got to turn my, I've had to, you know, rejig my goals and set them at the highest level. So, you know, I want to be a part of an, you know, an NBA championship winning team. I want to get the boomers into a gold medal game and, 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 and win, win that gold. So, the goals are right there at the top. Um, you know, that's they're the first things on my mind, and I know that if I take care of those, the the, the financial aspects of it all and all of that will take care of themselves. But I'm really trying to just hone in on on, on that and, and continuing to grow into that day by day, and and that gets me out of bed. You know, that spurs me on uh, through all my workouts, and and I'm just I'm really focused on those two things right now. Spurs you on? Can't get the spurs out of your mind, huh? <laughs> Low blow, uh, <laughs> yeah, but... Yeah. Hey, what'd you think of the vision you would have seen from Bainesy back on the floor the other day? I'm so happy for Baines. Uh Again, had dinner with him last night. He's in good spirits and, and I know he wasn't in good spirits for a while there just with the way things were going, you know. Knowing him, it would have been tough sitting around a house just kind of rehabbing and doing all that stuff. You know, the guy loves to play basketball. He wants to be out on the court competing with the best of them. And you felt that fire, you know, when we when we all caught up last night. He was talking that talk, and you know, saying he wants to be out there doing all this stuff. So um, to see him moving the way he was, and you know, I've seen a few clips here and there. I haven't seen it in person like I would like to, but to to, to see those clips kind of come out and, and the way he's evolved from you know not being able to get out of bed or you know he was laying on the ground essentially. Um, it's it's pretty moving stuff like it's that's a story you know uh, I'm just happy that the guy can you know just play with his kids and do all that kind of stuff so now he's got that added benefit of being able to hopefully get back in the NBA and do this here so I'm really I'm really pumped for bangers and yeah I think we all are all right just to finish up man I still can't get over the fact that at the beginning you said you want to win an NBA championship the Suns we've never won a title ever there's no the champion there are no championship banners Hanging in that arena, so go ahead and bring one home. Yeah, that, that would be good. I think that's what they're building towards. You can feel that buzz throughout the organisation from the guys I've spoken to. They're, that's what's on their mind. So uh, it would be pretty special to be a part of that. Cheers, man. Appreciate Cheers. you. Thank you. Thanks. Good to see you.